Federal law provides severe civil and criminal penalties for unauthorized duplication, distribution, or exhibition of copyrighted videotapes. The Universal Defense Development Institute, Incorporated will aggressively pursue violators and seek prosecution to the fullest extent of the law and all applicable civil and criminal remedies available. Thank you for your cooperation in this matter. While this instructional video will introduce a superior police controlling and handcuffing technique, we assume no responsibility for injuries resulting from the use of or application of the methods contained herein, be they in a training atmosphere or an actual street confrontation. The O'Donnell Continuous Control System was designed to reduce use of force-related injuries to the suspect while offering the officer a greater degree of control. As with any physical defense or control technique, injury is always possible. Care must always be taken to ensure the safety of both the officer and the suspect. The Universal Defense Development Institute Incorporated, the International Aikido Association, the Cody Police Department, the Park County Sheriff's Department, and Sunrise Productions assume no liability for any injuries inflicted by the use of any technique contained on this video. Consult your physician before beginning this or any other type of physical activity. Mr. Stephen O'Donnell, currently a uniformed police officer, has worked for city, county, and federal law enforcement agencies. A black belt in the art of Aikido, he has studied several martial arts, in addition to police defensive tactics and military hand-to-hand -hand combat. He 
is president of the Universal Defense Development Institute Incorporated, which offers services and instruction in martial arts, police defensive tactics, self-defense and personal protection. The reason Mr. O'Donnell developed the O'Donnell Continuous Control System was to help increase officer safety. Congratulations on your purchase of Volume 1. I'm Steve O'Donnell, founder of the O'Donnell Continuous Control System. Today's officers need simple, highly effective techniques that are designed to cause no serious injury. Very few officers will continue their defensive tactics training after leaving the academy. Of what real value is it then to teach a large number of complicated techniques? Why not teach one simple technique that with a slight modification can be applied to any situation? They might just remember it, and better yet, they might just use it. In volume one, I'll show you the basics of OCCS handcuffing. I'll show you how to safely enter a subject's danger zone, how to obtain proper hand placement, and how to lock the joint. I will demonstrate for you two basic pinning techniques and two basic takedowns. We will go through the entire handcuffing procedure, including the search. And finally, I will introduce to you the OCCS escort and come along. You are about to see a commonly taught come along and transitional controlling technique. Observe what happens when Mr. O'Donnell plays the role of the bad guy. It is not the intent of Mr. O'Donnell or UDDI to criticize, demean, or prove ineffective techniques currently being taught throughout the country. Mr. O'Donnell and UDDI are committed to the constant development and improvement of police defensive tactics with the hope that officers' lives will be saved. Watch another commonly taught technique, sometimes called the armbar. If the fine points of this technique are taught, it becomes fairly effective. However, these things are rarely shown in recruit training academies. Watch this commonly taught handcuffing technique. Another common procedure is to remove the handcuffs and actually enter the subject's danger zone with the handcuffs in hand. Studies show that when placed under a great deal of stress, officers tend to maintain a grip on whatever they are holding, even as they fall to the ground. This could cost you your life. Now you have seen some of the weak areas or disadvantages of some commonly taught techniques. Now, we'd like to introduce you to the ultimate in police defensive tactics, the O'Donnell Continuous Control System.